like a fool Treat me mean and cruel But love me Break my faithful heart Resist the urge of going, thank you, thank you very much, at the end of every song. <laughs> I know, I've done it for the whole night. Let's see, I want to give you a little bit of a tidbit about this song. That's All Right, Mom is the first commercial single release Elvis Presley put out, written and originally performed by blues singer Arthur Crudup. Presley's version was recorded on July 5th, 1954, and released on July 19th. So the B-side was Blue, Con Blue Moon of Kentucky, and it, was, uh, it came out on, on Sun Records. So here's a little of That's All Right, Mama.
I sound like 45 people. You are 145 people. We're probably 145 years old. I'll add it up. <coughs> I'm just coming off of that horrific flu. Gosh, it's giving my voice just a good edge, an Elvis edge. Everybody's probably at home with that. I know, right? That's where everybody is. This is Ben on drums. this music. So this one, I don't know that much about. Who knows something about So Glad You're Mine? It was written by Arthur Crudup again. 
He did a lot of those songs for Elvis, or he actually did them many years prior to Elvis, and Elvis heard them and did them too. We're going to do this Arthur Crudup style. right
himself for speed. He got everything man in the whole world I need. He cries, ooh, 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 I believe I'll change my mind. He says. baby. Thank you. Arthur Crudup's version of So Glad You're Mine. Let's see if I have a little history on this song. Everybody hanging in there? All right. Little Sister was written by Doc Pumice and Mort Schumann. They wrote a lot of songs for Ray Charles, too. It was originally released as a single in 1961 by Presley, who turned it into a number five hit on the Billboard Hot 100. Uh, it reached number one in the UK. The song would be covered by artists such as Dwight Yoakam, Robert Plant, Pearl Jam, and Rye Cooter. Little Sister. Don't you, little sister, don't you, little sister, don't you kiss me once or twice, tell me that it's nice and then you run, little sister, don't you do what your big sister does. the 
system. Thank you, thank you so much. This is one of my favorite songs. I hope you guys like it too. you guys. Oh, let's see. Everybody knows this song. You can please sing along. Don't be cruel. Oh! 
Sweet song. Elvis does a little diatribe in the middle of it that I'm going to skip because I just can't do it justice. If you'd like to slow dance with your sweetheart, there's plenty of room. Are you lonesome tonight? Do you miss me tonight? Are you sorry we drifted apart? Does your memory
Thank you so much. It's a sad, sweet song, isn't it? All right. This one goes out to my husband because he's a bigger hunk of hunk of burning now. My friend Joe and I share the same birthday, which is August 16th, the day that Elvis died, the date that Elvis died. And Aretha Franklin died on August 16th, too, so the king and the queen died on our birthday. But something, something is in there. Was it that he did that special in the leather jacket? 68 special. He did this one 
an extended version of it. We're going to keep it palatable. Anytime anybody wants to help, I clap. so much. <laughs> Accidental looping going on up here. Okay. 
Are you guys hanging in there? Cool, cool, cool. So I've got some CDs over here. We've got a little tip jar here. If you put $5 or more in that tip jar, you get yourself a CD. Rosemarie McCoy wrote this next song. Traveling night and day, I kept running all the way, baby, trying to get to you. his night he would shine his brightest light baby it's a, a man in love thank you so much trying to get to you all right this is another sweet song I don't care if the sun don't shine. So 
Thank you, thank you so much. Here's another song that you can slow dance to.
Oh, it's the greatest. One of the greatest love songs ever written. Thank you, everybody. Thanks so much. So let's see if I got anything about this one. Oh, my tablet is messing up. Bear with me. Bad tablet. Those stinking computers. Ba -doom -boom. All Shook Up was Presley recorded the song at, excuse me, Radio Recorders in Hollywood on January 12, 1957. Take 10 was selected for release, and in March, the song entered Billboard's top 100 charting at number 25. Within three weeks, it had knocked Perry Como's round and round off the top spot and <laughs> stayed there for eight consecutive weeks. The song also became Presley's first UK number one single, remaining there for seven weeks. Sales of the single exceeded two million, and the song was named Billboard's, Billboard's year end number one song for 1957, the year I was born. <laughs> Yay! Anybody else born in 1957? <coughs> okay. 1937. Well, not too <laughs> far off. Uh. Something seven. As long as no one's here from 2007. Oh, probably not. <laughs> Do what? <laughs> Alex is the youngest person here, I'm sure. Shook up, uh -huh. hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. My hands are shaking and my knees are weak. I can't seem to stand on my own two feet. Who do you think who has such luck? I'm in love. I'm all shook up. Let's see who wrote that. 
Otis Blackwell. Yeah. yeah. We're going to keep going here. We've got... So, you know, you might know a little bit of history about One Night of Sin. They made him change the words before he released it to the public. But we're going to do the original version, the PG-13 version of One Night of Sin. I might have to do another cough drop in the soon, so. <laughs> I know, I'm just updating everybody.
I didn't sow Fantasize last night about coming out with a being pregnant one night of sin isn't now what I'm praying about. 62 and pregnant. <laughs> so it's probably nothing to joke about. <laughs> all right, this song has lots of verses, but they're all good ones. Well, since my baby left me, I found a new place to dwell. It's down at the end of lonely streets called Public Hotel. Oh, baby, be so lonely, baby. It's be so lonely. We're so lonely, we could die. Although it's always crowded, you still can find some room. They're so lonely, baby. They are so lonely. They're so lonely. They could die. Yeah, the bell hops, tears keep flowing, and the desk clerk's dressed in black. But well, they've been so long on lonely streets, they'll never, no, never look back. And They're so lonely, they could die. Alex Tau. Place. 
We've been there, Heartbreak Hotel. This is one of my very favorite songs of all songs. I first heard it not from Elvis Presley, but from um, Patty Griffin. I do have something fun to say about this song. I'd really like to say it if I could find it. Tomorrow Night is a 1939 song written by Sam Coslow and Will Groves. The song was recorded by Elvis Presley during his tenure at Sun Records on his LP, Elvis for Everyone, from July 1965. It's a song called Tomorrow Night. <laughs> so tender Your heart is beating fast As you willingly surrender To be my darling at last To
Thank you so much. It's a really pretty song, isn't it? All right, we've got just a few songs left. So, My Baby Left Me was also a song written by Arthur Crudup. And Elvis stayed pretty true to the version that Arthur did years ahead of him. Thank you. What about this band? Alex Taub on keys, everybody. Jonathan Perlman on guitar and backing vocals. Grant Cuthbertson on the upright bass. Ben Biorley on the drums. Thank you, Ritus. Yeah. Oh, thank you very, very much. <laughs> This is a, my um, second all-time favorite Elvis tune. I should know the words. I, I love it. Yes? Yes? <laughs> Taking a reference to Jonathan Perlman's Production House, Alien Music Club.
your smile so tender My heart was captured My soul surrendered I spent a lifetime Waiting for the right time Now that you're near The time is here At last dramatic just what we need drama it's just too soft and pretty and I don't have my soft and pretty voice so we're gonna skip to our last song we're gonna pretend like there was oodles of people here and they just had to hear another one so yeah encore Um, Love Me Tender. It's such a beautiful song. Maybe you want to sing it? I know, really putting you on the spot. I have the words. If I start sounding like a moose. <coughs> All right. Love me tender. Love me sweet.
Thank you so much. Thank you. We so much appreciate you guys being here tonight. So lovely that you arrived. So we all have to sing this song. I wish I had some blue suede shoes. And then Grant showed up and he said, hey, I have blue suede shoes at home. Why didn't I wear them? Brown suede shoes he had to wear. <coughs> well, it's one for the money, two for the show, three to get ready now. Thank you very much. Thank you very much.
Alex Taub, Jonathan Perlman, Grant Cuthbertson, Ben Biorley. Thank you so much. If you'd like a CD or if you'd like to tip, we're, we got a tip jar. We so much appreciate y'all for coming out tonight. See you on the flip side.